Welcome back. Uh, time for our last part of the show, which is hey. our best boy and cameraman here, uh, <laughs> Jerry boy. Nissen. He uh, looks like showed up with size I brought 22 notes. font on his uh, white sheet of paper. I could read that from my car as I pulled in, Jerry. But I uh, want to be able to read it from the space shuttle. Jerry is a former president of the Lions Club and yes. uh, still a very active role with the Lions Club. It's, true. And it's a pretty big time of year. Uh, we got some huge fundraisers going on for the Lions Club. Absolutely. And so that's what we're here to talk about. Yeah. Yeah. The big thing that's coming up uh, Friday, December 2nd is the Festival of Trees. Give us a quick rundown. What it's, is the Festival of Trees? It's an annual event that we do uh, from Lions Club. It's at the, um, the rec center, the Grand Park Community Rec Center, and 4 to 8 p.m. What it is, in a nutshell, is the Lions Club buys trees, which we sell, but we give trees from our inventory to like 30 nonprofits in the community. Holy cow, I didn't realize that. that yeah, okay. and the nonprofits decorate them. They typically have a theme, you know, pet pals. They have a lot of fun with it, too. They have a right, lot of fun. Yeah, pet pals the, will do animal it's not just tinsel and balls. And it's, dog yeah. bones and, yeah, and the Blues Society has done it with CDs and tickets to blues festivals and so on in the past. Every organization decorates their own tree, and you can bid on the trees, and uh, it's a silent auction. And I assume there's beverages and other <coughs> there, uh, course, activities going on between course. 4 and 8 it's on Lions December 2nd. It's Club. Of course there are beverages. <laughs> Is there a shuffleboard? No, I'm just kidding. No. <laughs> there should be. Yeah. We'll think about that, Michael. That'd be fun in the corner. Yeah, shuffleboard. Yeah, there we go. Board. I knew it. Yeah. But, uh, but, but no, no, great event. A, absolutely a blast. And it's free. So you don't, have to, you don't have to commit free. to buying a tree. You can no. just go there you can come and in. be a part of the event. You can um, look at all the trees, which are really fun. Talk to the people that run the different nonprofits. Find out what the nonprofits are all about, what their story is. They get to keep 100% of the money that they sell the, the trees nonprofit for. Does. The nonprofit does. What a great way to support each no all so, the nonprofits. Yeah, if it's Pet Pals and they sell the tree for 500 bucks, Pet Pals gets 500 bucks. Oh, that's Lions great. Lions takes nothing. And there's uh, beverages to be had and appetizers, and it's all free. The whole thing is free. Oh, how fantastic. And you know, what a great way and if you've got a special connection to any nonprofit in town, you know, get, get a little competitive and, and win that bid so absolutely. you know it's going to the cause you absolutely. support. Absolutely. And we even have Santa there for the kids from five until 6.30. So and the adults. we take photos of the yeah. kids with Santa. <laughs> nice. And make it a lot of fun. And Lions Club, as part of this, uh, is also doing a raffle We've got 1600 bucks worth of stuff that we're raffling off, which is why I brought this. I didn't want to forget anything. It's the, the raffle tickets are five bucks a piece or six for 25, and I have some. And uh, you get dinner if you win. You get dinner for two at Sunspot and a snowcat ride. And you also get uh, at the YMCA, the Rockies here between Granby and Tabernash, you get dinner for four and a sleigh ride. Pretty, and pretty uh, Pole Creek Golf Club, you get a round of golf for two and a $25 gift card and a, a half day ATV rental in Grand Lake. And also a balloon ride. Is there a website that we can just go look at all these options? FraserValleyLions.org. We better, we better go that route because uh, my pen just ran dry as I was taking notes there. But uh, FraserValleyLions.org. Check them out. They're going to have all the auction off uh, prizes right. as right. well as the Festival of Trees December 2nd, 4 to December 2nd, 4 to 8. All right. We're also selling trees. This year we've moved it. We big moved big it news. To Moving location moved to Fraser. Our tree location. It's not at King's Crossing. Much anymore. better fence this year. We have an actual fence that is locked and yeah. night, making uh, shrinkage Murdoch's, less of an issue, we hope. Murdoch's is wonderfully donating the space. Murdoch's is cooperating with us. They're, they're donating the space. They're taking money when we're not there. We have Lions Club oh. volunteers around on weekends. So they can even go into Murdoch's and purchase the tree if you're not Yeah, around. exactly. And our trees come in on the 19th of November. So, 19th of Lions? November, be looking for it. That's anytime any, after yeah, that. Yep. Yeah, yep. And uh, all the way to Christmas, they'll be selling trees. Absolutely. Jerry, we got to take off. Thanks so much for sharing the uh, info there. Once again, Festival of Trees, December 2nd from 4 to 8 p.m. FraserValleyLions.org. Check these guys out. Uh, a lot of great things going on. And uh, that wraps up our show today, Jerry. So, right. I don't know if you got to catch all of it. Of course you did, because you're the cameraman. <laughs> but uh, great show. Big thanks to Steph Carey for showing us Be Jamming and all that's new here, including Leo's Kitchen in uh, yep. Cooper Creek Square. Uh, we had Tim Hubbard talking about Grand County Blues Society and Vertical Bistro. We also had 
work with me, Mary, with the uh, the uh, dietitian. The dietitian. Um, you know, really right. interesting information. Right. Uh, appreciate that. Talked about diabetes. And uh, you know, big plug for Middle Park Medical Center on that one. MPMC.org, state of the art medical facilities we have right here right. in Grand County, which is pretty incredible. Great. Uh, forgetting someone, and that someone is our gear guide, Peter Ledoux, uh, local legend. Find him in shorts at Christie Sports downstairs. Uh, the boot expert. Cooper Square. The boot expert, indeed. So, uh, thanks to all our sponsors. Uh, once again, see you guys out there on the hill. I'm ready to go uh, shred some grass, I guess, because there's not a lot of snow. But hopefully, there will be when you're watching this. We'll see you.